Juicy J. Uh-huh. Let's rage. Hey guys, it's me, Miranda, and today I'm going to be doing the best of 2013. Wait, what? Hi, guys. So, it's Mallory, not Miranda. If you know that reference, I love you. If you don't, I still love you, but... Yeah, so today I'm doing the best of 2013 tag. Well, I'm not going to be answering the questions. I'm just going to be telling you guys the products that I love. So, really, this is just my favorite 2013 products. And it includes beauty, fashion, random stuff, and then just, like, fun things I did in 2013. Just kind of, like, a recap of the whole 2013 year. I know, I know, I know, I know, I know. I'm so, so late on this. I'm so sorry. I just have been so busy with school and finals and everything because I just took my last final yesterday and it was actually pretty easy so I'm not that mad about it but all my finals were easy so anyways I know that's not a good excuse but it is my excuse so I'm sorry I still wanted to put this up though I was debating on doing it because I was really late but I was like you know what let me just do it because I already wrote down everything that I needed to talk about and all that stuff and I have it like all right here so I was like you know what why not just do it and it'll just be late, so you know, whatever. Okay, so the first category is beauty, and the first thing I've been loving is this mascara. It is the Colossal Volume Express Mascara by Maybelline, and I got this for like, I think like eight bucks, so it's like really inexpensive, and I love it. I've been using this the whole year. I've also been loving this eyeliner by Revlon. It is the Color Stay Eyeliner, and it's black, because that's the only color eyeliner I wear, but... Yeah, I love this so much. Of course, gotta include my baby lips. So I have these two medicated ones to show you guys. This one is in the shade Coral Crave. And this one's in the shade Soothing Sorbet, I think. And I just love these so much. I wear them every single day. I've also been loving my little EOS ones that my cousin gave me. And this is the pink one, as you can tell. I just, I love it. I've been loving this lipstick. It's in the shade Vivid Rose. And it's just this really cool, like, bright, well, it's kind of bright, but it's like a rosy color, I guess. I don't really know, but you guys have seen it before. I've also really gotten into nail polish this year. I don't know why. Just like all of a sudden, I started like a nail polish, which that's probably because I went into Delia's and I bought something and they gave me free nail polish. And then ever since then, I've been buying lots of nail polishes. So this one is my favorite for this year. This is the free one that I got from Delia's and it's actually really nice for something that's free. And it's just this like silvery color. Okay. This has been my absolute favorite product this whole year, well, last year, and it is the Persa Gel 10 Maximum Strength Acne Medication, and this just works so, so well. I'm actually, this is actually empty right now, but I have another one in my bathroom, but I just got this one out of there to show you guys, and I love it so much. It's by Clean and Clear. You guys should definitely try it. It's, like, it's amazing. This eyeshadow just... It's my favorite ever and I used it a lot for 2013 because it's just like neutral colors. It's like browns and you can just wear it with like any outfit and any occasion and I just, I don't know, I got a lot of use out of it. And these are my favorite makeup wipes for 2013. They are the Pond's Wet Palettes and they're really great. So I love this body lotion a lot. It is the Beauty Counter Hydrate Everyday Body Lotion and it is so amazing. You guys should definitely try it. It just looks like that and it's really great and it smells really, really good. So I almost just dropped it. All right, and I don't know if you would really count this as beauty, but I'm just going to put it in this category anyway because it's right there with my stuff. So it is this, what is it? body mist. I don't know how I forgot that, but it's by Pink, and I have, like, three of these now. I got this one for Christmas, but I've been using the other one I had for, like, a long time, but now I'm starting to use this one. It is the warm and cozy one, so you guys should definitely try it. It's pretty great. So that was all the beauty stuff, so now moving on to fashion. The first fashion favorite I have, bows. I just, oh my gosh, I got my first bow in 2013, and I just bought this one, like, few weeks ago and it's just black and it's really cool I like it but I've already worn it a few times too and I love it so yeah. I don't know why but I've been wearing these earrings so much for 2013 and 
They just are little black studs and I just wear these like every day because they go with everything and they're so easy and they don't like get caught in your hair when you wear hoops or something like that. So I love these and I forget where they're from because I've had them forever but you know. They're like little magnetic balls. Well, they're not magnetic, but... Okay, and this necklace is probably my favorite necklace ever. It is this little infinity sign necklace, and it's silver, and I got it at the beach a while ago, and I just, I wear this with so much stuff because it goes with everything, and I love it. The last jewelry piece that I have to show you guys, you guys can probably guess because I've shown you in so many videos, it's my big blue necklace, and I just, I love it so much. I love the color, I love the little bubbles, and I just love it. I don't know. <laughs> I actually have a lot of shoes to show you guys. I have, wait, one, two, three, four, five. Five-ish pairs of shoes, because I just, I don't know, I fell in love with so many shoes this year, I don't know. But the first pair is just my black flip-flops, and I just, I wear these with everything in the summer because they go with everything. But when I'm not wearing my flip-flops, I'm wearing my sandals, and these are from Kohl's, and they have these cool little, like, gold little details on them, and they're brown, and I really like them, and I just, we just, I also gotta show you my white Converse, because they're amazing, and I love them, I don't know why I'm talking like that, but anyways, they're just the low ones, I guess, and I wear them with a lot, shorts. Dresses, skirts, pants, jeans, whatever I want. So, I just, I love these. Ooh, they almost fell out of my hand. So, you guys know I have to include my wedges from Target, and I love them. They're great, they're amazing, they're perfect, they're fantastic, and I just, I really like them. Those are the shoelaces. <laughs> And 2013 was the first year that I've ever purchased slash worn heels. They're just these tan heels and they are pretty high as you can tell. These are the highest heels I own but I really like them and I mean how do you not buy heels you like that are only like eight bucks? Well not even eight but so I just really like these and I've worn them a couple times. I've worn them from New Year's to my well my aunt's party and I just I love these heels so much. <sighs> okay, so I kind of got into a little, little obsession. And I just don't know how this happened, but it did. And I am now part of the Beanie family. Okay, so I got this beanie in New York City when I went with my mom for the day. And it's just a black beanie. And I actually forget where this is from, but I just really like this so much and I'm going to get a lot more because I love this one. Alright, and can we just talk about this dress? Okay, so I got this for Easter and I just, I'm like in love with it. It's my favorite dress ever. I've worn it so many times. So it just has this navy blue and white stripes at the top and then it goes into floor print, which I think the stripes on the floor look really good with each other. And I just, I wore this so much. I, just, I love it so, so much. Like... You don't even understand. I'm like in love with this dress. And I kind of got into circle skirts this year. Well, not kind of. More like a lot. But I got this black circle skirt from Kohl's. And it has like, I don't know if you can be able to tell, but it has this floral pattern in it kind of. And I just really like it. I wore it a lot. And it was on sale for like 20 bucks. So it can't really get much better than that. So yeah, I love my little circle skirts, skater skirts, whatever you want to call them. I've also been loving my high-waisted shorts. I got these from one of the stores at the beach for like 13 bucks because they were on sale and they're just orange and they look like this. So they're not too high-waisted but they are a little bit high-waisted which I like and I love the color of them and I just, I don't know, I've worn these a lot in 2013. I've also gotten into lace shorts. So I got these from the same store and the same time that I got the orange shirt shorts and these are just mint green lace shorts. They have three layers of lace and I also got these in black but I kind of like these a lot more even though they don't go with that much but I like to like the color and I mean I like the black too because they go with a lot but I just I love my lace shorts. Alright and I kind of got into maxi skirts and maxi dresses this year. I only have one of each and I'm just going to show you the skirt. So this is the maxi skirt that I have. My one and only maxi skirt, maxi skirt right now but I'm definitely getting more because I love this one. And this one's from PacSun. It is sheer but it has a little slip underneath so you know nothing will be visible. 
But anyways, it's just these really cool sunflowers, and it has these two slits at the bottom. As you can tell, and I just really like it. And I can't wait to wear it in the summer because I got it like at the end of summer, so now I have to wait to wear it in the summer. But I really like it. it makes me feel like I'm the flower princess or something. Also been loving my fuzzy socks, so like these striped ones and my other socks inside of this one. So that's why there's like a lump, but. Yeah. Now I got this two years ago for Christmas 2012 and it was my black North Face and I wear it every single day in 2013, well every single day in like fall and winter, but I just got a lot of use out of it and I really like it and it's great. I've been also really liking my polka dot jeans from Target and they're actually a little short on me but I just roll them up and they look fine because I really wanted them so I got them anyway but they have rips and polka dots and I just I love them so much I've also really gotten into scarves this year scars I said scarves it's scarves Mallory okay so I've gotten into scarves this year and I got this one from Mi Madre and it just looks like this it has these cool colors in it and this cool texture and I really like it it reminds me of the ocean or something these guys these I really like these and they're just floral leggings that I got from Target for like, not Target, Paxson for like 20 bucks. And I love the colors in them. And they're so comfortable. And I love them so much. And they feel like sweatpants. But they're really, really cool. Alright, and I got into Brandy Melville this year. So, um, I got this shirt. And it's actually from Paxson, but it's from Brandy Melville because they sell some Brandy Melville stuff. So, I got my moon shirt and I really like it. I know like so many people have this shirt but I just I really like it and I think it's really cool and it's just great and I also got something else from Brittany Melville but I'm gonna show that in a haul and if I can find it because I don't know where it went. I kind of got into strapless shirts too so I got this one from PacSun and my cousin got it too because she likes to copy me. She also got the heels that I showed you guys and some other stuff too but you know whatever so we both got this shirt on the same day, and it is so cool. It's like a floral print, and it has this cool ruffle right here, and I really like it, and it's great. I also love strapless dresses, too, but yeah, I like my strapless things. Speaking of strapless things, I've also gotten into rompers this year. So I have my one and only romper to show you guys. This one's from Delia's, and it was like 20 bucks, and it has pockets. And it's strapless, as you can probably tell. And it just cinches in at your waistline and then goes down like that. And I think it's really pretty. I love the print of it. I love the colors. And I just love it in general. I've also been loving my brown belt because I wear it like every day with everything. Because it's so neutral and yet it's really cute. So, yeah. Oh, we dropped it. And the last two things in my fashion category jean vest, jean jacket, or a denim vest, denim jacket, however you want to call it, but I love these items so much. This one's from Delia's, this one I forget where it's from, but I just really love these, and I like pairing them over tank tops, or shirts, or, well, obviously shirts, but yeah, I really like them. Alright, and now to random things. Sorry if I moved a little bit, but my leg was really starting and hurt me, so I had to move, but anyway, so the first thing I want to talk to you guys about, where is it? is my day trip to New York City. So I went to New York City with with my mom for the day in like one day in December or something. I think it was like the 18th or something. I don't know, something like that. But we went for the day and it was really fun. And I went to a chocolate restaurant and it was just, it was heaven to my mouth, to my whole entire body. It was just, it was so good. And I just, I just, oh my gosh. I. I, I love it. I also loved Under the Dome, and it started in, like, July or something, and ended, maybe it ended in July, I don't know, but it started and ended in that year, well, the first part of it, I guess, I don't know if there's other parts to it, but I love that show, I love that show so much, and I really wish it would come back on, because I miss it a lot. My top three favorite songs of 2013 is Cruise. Counting Stars and Dark Horse. I love those songs so much and they're great and amazing and perfect. I also ran a couple of races this year. So I ran a chocolate run, which just, you guys know. It. Anyways, I ran a chocolate run, I ran a snowman run, and I ran more runs, but those were the few, like those were the top two favorites of mine. 
And then also I have a favorite food for you guys. Bring it around to you. I don't know what I'm doing. But anyways, it's ramen noodles, ramen noodles, however you want to say it. But I'm pretty sure it's ramen. But I say ramen because, you know, why not? I also started high school in 2013. So I had my high school volleyball thing go on in 2013 and I really liked it. It was a lot of fun and I really liked my team. I liked everyone on it. They were all really nice and really funny and yeah, I kind of miss them a lot. Anyways, I just, I loved my team and it was a lot of fun playing with them. So I went to Disney and Universal both in the same year but like at different times. So I went to Disney in January about, I think it was actually like this time last year I was in Disney World, like right now. But I went there with my family and it was a lot of fun. And then we went to Universal in like July, I think, or June, July, something like that. Somewhere in the summer, I don't know. But we went there and it was a lot of fun as well because my mom wanted to run a race. So it was a lot of fun as well. And I've never been to Universal before, so it was, it was pretty good. Okay, and the last thing that I want to talk to you guys about is the start of my YouTube channels because I started my YouTube channels, both of them, in 2013. I started this channel, my main channel, in I think July, June or July, something like that. And then I started my vlog channel about a month or two ago. So I just, I started my YouTube channels in 2013. So that's pretty exciting for me. And I just, I wanted to thank you guys so much for making 2013 a really great year for me. For like, supporting me and just watching my videos and it really means a lot to me you guys probably don't know that it does but it really does mean a lot to me that you guys take the time to watch my videos and to comment on my videos and you guys are just all so nice like you guys are amazing and I love each and every single one of you who watches my videos and I hope that you guys all have a wonderful 2014 year and a wonderful rest of your life and I hope you guys do whatever you want to do this year and I hope you're happy with this year and I just wanted to thank you guys for supporting me when I was starting my YouTube channel last year and supporting me all the way up until now and this year is going to be the first year that I have YouTube the whole year round so I'm very excited for that I want to see where it takes me I'm kind of excited to see where it takes me and I'm excited to see you guys come along with me on my YouTube journey, I guess, and I just love you guys so much. You guys are amazing, so thank you to every single one of you that watch my videos. I love you guys so much, and I just, you guys are amazing. Alright, and that's the end of this video. I really hope you guys liked it, and I know it's, it's late. I'm sorry about that, but as I said before, I was just so busy with finals and everything like that, so I'm just glad I'm getting it up now, so sorry about that. I just, I didn't have any time to film it, but yeah, so I hope you guys liked this video. Give it a thumbs up if you did, and I hope to see you guys. Well, I don't hope, because I will see you guys soon, so I'll see you guys soon. I'll talk to you later. Adios, amigos. I'm wearing sweats, and I don't match, but I don't care. And I'm wearing banana socks, because they're yellow. I could just... I could just... just...